Would I rather be feared or loved? Um, easy, both. I want people to be afraid of how much they love me. Let the bells of Dunder Mifflin chime out your love. You have no idea how high I can fly. You cannot learn from books. Replace these pages with life lessons, and then you will have a book that is worth its weight in gold. You need to play to win, but you also have to win to play. Make friends first, make sales second, make love third, in no particular order. You know what they say, fool me once, strike one, but fool me twice, strike three. May your hats fly as high as your dreams. I knew exactly what to do, but in a much more real sense, I had no idea what to do. I'm not superstitious, but I'm, I am a little stitious. Here's the sitch. Two weeks ago, I was in the worst relationship of my life. She treated me poorly, we didn't connect, I was miserable. Now, I'm in the best relationship of my life with the same woman. Love is a mystery. An office is a place where dreams come true. Society teaches us that having feelings and crying is bad and wrong. Well, that's a baloney because grief isn't wrong. There is such a thing as good grief. Let's ask Charlie Brown. My heart soars with the eagle's nest. Why don't I tell you what my greatest weaknesses are? I work too hard, I care too much, and sometimes I can be too invested in my job. Okay. And your strengths? Well, my weaknesses are actually strengths. Oh. Yes. Very good. To get perspective, I like to think about a spaceman on a star incredibly far away. And our problems don't matter to him because we're just a distant point of light. But he feels sorry for me because he has an incredibly powerful microscope and he can see my face. Just seems awfully mean. But sometimes the ends justify the mean. People will never be replaced by machines. In the end, life and business are about human connections. And computers are about trying to murder you in a lake. <laughs>